You're wearing jeans, right? I, <laughs> I'm switching I am. gears a little bit. Okay, well, you wear them very well. Thank and you, thank you. Some people are starting to wear smart jeans. Well, at least Google wants you to. At their annual developer conference Friday, the company announced plans to partner with jeans maker Levi Strauss to bring touchscreen capabilities <laughs> to your clothing. Stan, just touch fill us in. What does this mean? Or at jeans. least touch capabilities. I mean, people have talked about, like, we've seen people with, like, goofy t shirts that have, like, you know, you can touch them and things will light up or they'll make sounds. Uh, they want to do something a little bit more sophisticated. Uh, they want to add conductive thread to clothing so that you could somehow connect it to, let's say, a smartwatch or a smartphone and interact with it. You could, let's say, Raise and lower the volume on your MP, you know, three player on your phone. Because it's by, so by hard your to pick up your device it. and just go like they this. They say the same thing about the watches. Oh, you know, it's hard to take your phone out of your pocket, so you use the watch. So if they use this conductor thread, and maybe they have a little bit of circuitry inside, like let's say it's something that's like a button, and that would enable you to have that connection, maybe a Bluetooth connection to your phone. It's experimental right now, but the concept makes sense because you could take the stuff and you could wash it, and you could make it look like regular clothing because you're just adding some conductive material to the fabric. <laughs> can you wash it? Though? Can you can, wash can it? You and what batteries? about batteries? Yeah, it would need a battery because it's just basically some like uh, a touch sensitive, you know, like uh, it takes the electricity from your fingers, kind of conductive material inside the fabric. You know, it, it's a concept piece right now. There probably won't be anything out for a year or so, but uh -huh. that they're working with Levi's on it, that at least means they're going to make normal looking clothes rather than some weird experimental stuff. So literally, if I wanted to hide from the NSA, I'd have to strip naked and, you know, walk oh, down geez, the street. Or, or take your touch clothes <laughs> and cover them with tinfoil. Right. <laughs> All right. It's wild. All right. Sounds interesting. Damn. I think it's probably a way for people to these companies. I've been saying this all along. Does it not seem to you that it's a way for these companies to get you to buy more stuff? It doesn't oh, really make your life is about that a much window easier. to commerce right. and removing that friction. I'd love to be standing in line at Starbucks and just take my sleep and, and write with my finger latte yeah. and have them know that when I get to the front of the line. All right. All right. Dan Ackerman, thanks for joining us as Thank always. Thank you.